Hello everyone, welcome to another Poly Bridge 2 video and today we are going back to recreating beautiful bridges. This time we are going to build Le, Le Francais Milau Viaduct or Milau Bridge, I really don't know. For the sake of this video we are going to call it bridge, I think it's more easy. <laughs> but yeah, uh, stick around and let's go. So now here in the sandbox mode, this bridge has around I think 2.5 kilometers long which is, let me do the calculation, around 1.5 miles long. So it's a very long bridge. <laughs> but this game, as we saw in the previous videos, only allow us to build up until 250 meters, something like that. Which is a lot already, so according to my calculations, to everything be proportional as possible, I think I will do like um, 204 meters long. Uh, bridge. So this one will be minus 102 and this one will be 102. So something like this seems good. Alright, and now we are going to do <laughs> the more complex part, I guess, because as you can see in the real pictures, this uh, viaduct or this bridge basically don't have any river I think they have only a small river, very small river that cross, but mostly is like a, um, a hill. So I will try to make that draw, then at the end I will do a brief explanation. So here we are, <laughs> you can see here in the picture that they only have a very small river that cross here. And yeah, I tried to draw the shape of this hill and then I, I just put some anchors for the columns. This bridge has seven very long columns and uh, anchors here for the, the board. Basically that's it. I think that's all we, we need here and then we can start building it. Let's go. So before starting building the actual bridge, the columns, they are made of reinforced concrete. So we could easily use like this pillar options here, which yeah, is basically a column that imitates concrete, I guess, here in the game. But if uh, we use this option, we basically are forcing this build, this uh, bridge to work here in the game because these elements are very stiff so they will not broke, which is okay of course. But before I would see if we can build the bridge using only the elements that we have here available in the real building mode. If not, I can always go back and do the columns with pillar elements, but yeah, I would like to start with only the elements here available. And I think doing like I'm trying to do here it will make this video more fun because it will be more difficult to do <laughs> so it will be more challenging and more fun at the same time but yeah I just want to give this brief explanation before starting and I will just start doing it now so let's start with the road which I actually don't know <laughs> if I just go ahead with reinforced road or not because of course the reinforced road is actually more heavy as well so maybe I will just go with the normal road and then I will see and change if needed so yeah let's just add like a straight line here to here and let's fill this let's go okay and now I think I will do just the bottom part here with steel bars and I want to make sure that these nodes are at the same position so it will be more easy to do the trusted thing so maybe something like that and then we can copy it all right and let's go and then here do it like that beautiful and maybe I did some mistakes here because maybe down here we can just add like a a straight element like this because it will make the structure more lighter and and then we can see if we need like a reinforced bar here or not but for now I think I will leave it like that so I will just delete this okay nice and now we can actually make the columns so as we can see because of the shape of this valley the columns will be with different length with different height I think the biggest column here is it has around 300 and something meters I think it's almost the same height of the Eiffel Tower and then I will maybe start here with the biggest column 
and I think I will do do it, do them like a little bit more thicker at the base and more thin to the top. So this bigger one here in the game will have like I think 34 meters, so 24 here and then more th 10 meters here at the top. So let's just do it like 34 straight, 34, and then let's do it a little bit inside. One to something like that then we can do like one meter here so here is the bottom part and the top part of the columns right then i think i will just go back like that take off the snap grid and then select here the steel and let's do it like something like here and then let's just copy this to the rest of the column something like that seems good and then Let's just do the same for the other side, so something like that, and then here the same thing. Now we can do the horizontal connections, alright, and then here we have to connect this. Okay, then we can do something like here maybe, just copy to this side and let's just delete this and connect it like that nice probably here we can do like this and then here in the middle something like that and then here the same thing with the road so like that all right and then let's just reinforce here these columns so something like that seems good all right and now we're gonna have to do the other columns <laughs> So yeah, here we have the bottom part of the columns done and now we have to do the upper part of these columns and for that we can just copy this part here and pass to the other columns and I just want to say that I fix here the position of these two nodes so this part here can just be assembly correctly so yeah let's just copy to the rest and let's go there we go basically have all the columns done and the board as well now the next part should be the cables let me just see how many cables you're going to need Probably one here, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, fourteen, fourteen. So it will be half, so seven, seven, right? So we're gonna need seven cables like that, and then seven cables like that. Before doing, putting the cables, we need to put the anchors, or the nodes here to connect the cables. In the real pictures you can see that in the columns the cables are very close to each other, the connection point, and then the space between them increase while they are connecting to the board. So here we have more or less two meters of, of space between the connections, so here I think I will do like one meter. So maybe we could start in the bottom, so something like here, then we could do like one meter something like that and let's just delete this and then this and then this and let's just copy to here and this as well and then do the same in the other side something like that and do the horizontal connections i will just delete this again and copy this to the rest of the columns yeah so something like that i think seems to be good and let's just do the cables now so we could start like here and then like that seems good one two three four five six and seven and then do the same to this side so let's copy and flip and just copy like that and then let's just copy the other side all right looking beautiful let's see if it can hold itself because <laughs> that is the most important part basically i think that's it it actually looks quite similar i mean of course the columns are different first they are red and then they are made of steel but yeah i explained before why i did this i think it's more fun like that but other than that the the cables the connection here seems very similar so yeah let's just see if it works <laughs> And then let's just play and see. Whoa, it actually works. Nice. <laughs> let's load this and see what it can hold. Let's start with the sport car. The car cross very easily the bridge, so let's just load 
even more this and go ahead with uh, yeah let's go ahead with this just see if it can hold increase a little bit oh my god oh no 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 so we have a uh, problem here i think uh, the real bridge if you can see in, in the picture they have like um, a support down here so probably the cable this cable or even this part is anchored in here in the bottom part i think i will just do or try to imitate the the real thing so i'm just going back to the sandbox and add like a an anchor here i think or maybe one here is the middle so let's go one and one again and do the same in the other side and then here we can do like a, a small structure to support this part something like that let's see if like that is good or not okay all right now seems to work better but yeah as you can see it actually works quite nice i think i will try to add some wood because like all the bridge this one also has like a barrier here to prevent uh, the vehicles to fall off the bridge so maybe i will simulate that barrier with wood and i think maybe with that it will help decrease a little bit the stress and it will make the bridge look a little bit more real so maybe i will do something like that Oh yeah, there we go. I add like a, a, a wood structure to simulate the barrier. Let's see if it helps. Seems everything good actually. Even the stresses value is kind of low. So I actually think if we put like a heavier vehicle, it will actually hold. Very impressive. The only problem is that my computer is almost dying right now. I have like 20 FPS, so if I increase this, it goes like to 7, 8, so... <laughs> oh my god, my CPU is dying right now. <laughs> I think I will just try to add, I mean, the heavy or the eco. Let's see if it can hold it. So the stresses here are okay. Oh, we have a lot of stresses there, but so far so good. All right going well yeah as you can see we have a lot of contrast concentrations in some points but then we can change that to reinforce the road and i think it's everything good actually all right it actually works so it can hold all of the vehicles just have to fix this piece here that is broken but yeah other than that everything seems good actually it's look quite similar i guess of course we have the color different because it's all red. It will be nice if we have an option here in the game to actually paint the bridge to maybe white or gray. And of course the real bridge is mostly made out of reinforced concrete. Both the columns and the road actually are made of it. But as I explained before, I thought it would be more fun to actually do with the materials available here in the game but let me know what you think your opinion about this bridge but yeah i think that's all i want to say if you liked the video if you have a good time watching it please leave a like subscribe as well i promise sometime in the future i will start doing other gameplays and yeah i think that's all thank you so much for watching and i see you in the next one bye